The fishing sector is faced with numerous challenges, including the non-availability of premise fuel for fisher folks to run their day-to-day -day activities. The National Premise Secretariat taxed with the distribution of premise fuel explaining the reason for the current shortage since last year attributed the shortage to holding, diversion and smuggling of the commodity. Nana Abrakwa Asari is administrator of the Premise 4 Secretariat. Premise 4 is highly subsidized by government. Um, it's even to the tune of about 85% um, subsidized, you know. So fishermen only used to pay just 15% and then government pays 80, um, the rest of, of the subsidy, you know. So it was huge and that was um, a bad on, on governments because um, anytime fuel is increased on the world market automatically means it also increases the subsidy level you know so last year became very difficult for us fishermen had it difficult getting premix fuel he added that the fishermen will now have access to premix fuel but at a higher price a gallon of premix fuel will be sold for um, 25.5 so almost 26 cities per gallon it used to be 10 CDs, um, 50 pesos per gallon, so um, it's going to be increased to 25.5 per gallon. So that should let us know that um, still, the subsidy is still there, you know, so the subsidy level is going to be about 50%. Um, we are still engaging with the leadership of the fishermen to let them know of the new increment. Next week, we'll hit the ground running again. The BDCs are ready to come back on stream. We've engaged them, we've had stakeholders meeting with MPA, uh, Ministry of Energy and all the stakeholders as far as um, Premix Fuel is concerned, especially the bulk distributing companies. We have agreed, our government has agreed that it's going to release condensate for them to blend and premise. Government has also assured them that um, we would also make sure we pay the under recoveries on time. You know, that has also been a challenge because um, at a point in time, the BDCs also were running out of cash.